Dear friends, in this part we are going to discuss about test of water, soft and hard water, water softening treatment. Let's start. Test of water. Question number 1. What are the different tests in order to ascertain the quality of water? What are the different tests in order to ascertain the quality of water? Answer physical test, chemical test and bacteriological test. Answer physical test, chemical test and bacteriological test. Which is the color of pure water? Which is the color of pure water? Answer colorless. Pure water is colorless. Which meter is used to measure the color of the water? Which meter is used to measure the color of the water? Answer tindometer. Answer tindometer. What is the purpose of osmoscope test? What is the purpose of osmoscope test? Answer to test taste and odor. To test taste and odor. Question number five. What is the desirable temperature of portable water? What is the desirable temperature of portable water? Answer 10 degree Celsius. Answer 10 degree Celsius. Question number six. How can we check the temperature of water? How can we check the temperature of water? Answer by ordinary thermometer. Answer by ordinary thermometer. What is the reason for turbidity in water? What is the reason for turbidity in water? Answer clay and silt particles. Answer clay and silt particles. Which instrument is used to check the turbidity? Which instrument is used to check the turbidity? Answer turbidity rod and nephlometer. Answer turbidity rod and nephlometer. Question number nine. What is the permissible turbidity of drinking water? What is the permissible turbidity of drinking water? Answer 5 to 10 ppm. Answer 5 to 10 ppm. Question number 10. ppm means ppm means dash. Answer parts per million. ppm means parts per million. Next part. Soft water and hard water. Let's continue. Soft water having hardness about dash degree. Soft water having hardness about dash degree. Answer 5 to 8 degree. Answer 5 to 8 degree. Next question. Temporary hardness in water is caused due to the salt like dash. Temporary hardness in water is caused due to the salt like dash answer carbonates answer carbonates temporary hardness in water is caused due to the salt like carbonates what is the main cause of temporary hardness what is the main cause of temporary hardness answer bicarbonates of calcium and magnesium answer bicarbonates of calcium and magnesium temporary hardness is known as dash temporary hardness is known as dash answer carbonate hardness answer carbonate hardness temporary hardness is known as carbonate hardness question number 15 what are the main causes of permanent hardness what are the main causes of permanent hardness Answer sulfates, chlorates, and nitrates of calcium and magnesium. Answer sulfates, chlorates, and nitrates of calcium and magnesium. Question number 16 Pressure which results from sudden stoppage of velocity of flow of water in a closed pipe is known as dash. Pressure which results from sudden stoppage of velocity of flow of water in a closed pipe is known as dash. Answer, water hammer. Answer, water hammer. Question number 17. 
in physical test what are the test we are doing in physical test what are the tests we are doing answer color taste and odor temperature turbidity answer color taste and odor temperature and turbidity which test is to find the hardness of water which test is to find the hardness of water answer chemical test answer chemical test next water softening treatment the permanent hardness cannot be removed easily from water the permanent hardness cannot be removed easily from water the special treatment is called as the water softening treatment the special treatment is called as the water softening treatment they are lime soda process zeolite process demineralization process and reverse osmosis lime soda process zeolite process demineralization process and reverse osmosis permanent hardness can be removed by lime soda process zeolite process demineralization process and reverse osmosis process question number 19 temporary hardness of water can be treated by dash temporary hardness of water can be treated by dash answer boiling answer boiling question number 20th which process is used to remove the calcium and magnesium from hard water which process is used to remove the calcium and magnesium from hard water answer zeolite process answer zeolite process which is also known as base exchange process or ion exchange process color of naturally available zeolite color of naturally available zeolite answer green answer green chemical name of zeolite chemical name of zeolite answer hydrated sodium aluminum silicate answer hydrated sodium aluminum silicate dash is artificial zeolite dash is artificial zeolite answer permutite answer permutite it is white in color it is white in color question number 24 which is the process of water preparation for industrial purpose from hard water which is the process of water preparation for industrial purpose from hard water answer demineralization process answer demineralization process which is the process of water softening treatment if hard water is passed through a bed of resin in the hydrogen form which is the process of water softening treatment if hard water is passed through a bed of resin in the hydrogen form answer demineralization process answer demineralization process which process works on the principle of diffusion in water softening treatment which process works on the principle of diffusion in water softening treatment answer reverse osmosis process answer reverse osmosis process question number 27 reverse osmosis also known as dash reverse osmosis also known as dash answer hyperfiltration answer hyperfiltration reverse osmosis works on the principle of dash reverse osmosis works on the principle of dash answer diffusion answer diffusion reverse osmosis works on the principle of diffusion question number 29 turbidity of water is expressed in terms of dash scale turbidity of water is expressed in terms of dash scale answer silica scale answer silica scale the maximum permissible total solid content in water for domestic purpose should not exceed dash ppm the maximum permissible total solid content in water 
for domestic purpose should not exceed dash ppm answer 500 ppm answer 500 ppm question number 31st the maximum permissible quantity of iron and manganese in water for domestic purpose should be dash ppm the maximum permissible quantity of iron and manganese in water for domestic purpose should be dash ppm answer 0.3 ppm answer 0.3 ppm the color of water is expressed in number of a dash scale the color of water is expressed in number of a dash scale answer platinum cobalt scale answer platinum cobalt scale the maximum permissible fluorine content in water for domestic purpose is dash ppm the maximum permissible fluorine content in water for domestic purpose is dash ppm answer 1.5 ppm answer 1.5 ppm temporary hardness can be removed by adding dash temporary hardness can be removed by adding dash answer slacked lime answer slacked lime next question hard water for public water supply is discarded because dash hard water for public water supply is discarded because dash answer it consumes more soap answer it consumes more soap question number 36 soft water is treated water in which the only ion is dash soft water is treated water in which the only ion is dash answer sodium answer sodium hardness of water is expressed in terms of dash hardness of water is expressed in terms of dash answer parts per million or mg per liter of calcium carbonate parts per million or mg per liter of calcium carbonate green zeolite is also known as dash green zeolite is also known as dash answer green sand answer green sand dear friends our today's video is over we will see with another topic if you like my videos please do like share comment subscribe to my channels thank you for watching